Action Matters. Scott Harris is taking over. Hold on, let me tune this bad boy. There's a twingy kind of string in there. Thanks for coming along. Sick. Glad to be at a fucking show. I've been on holidays or I resigned from my job, so yeah. I've been on holidays for the last like month and a half and there hasn't been too many shows. So you can imagine how uh, disappointing that is for me. So it's really good to uh, be able to come out and play a show. Fuck capitalism! Fuck capitalism! <laughs> well, I was, I was working for the government. <laughs> Socialism, I don't know. For the hospital, I was, you know. Oh. In particular. This is how the artist is taking over, because uh, I just need a bunch of back cuts and uh, sitting back, relaxing, and being lovely to each other.
Yeah. Sound good? It's like you're way too good for us. <laughs> we're fucking super stoked we had this film. We're um, big fans of all the bands playing with today. And my brother mates all going to be new mates, so we really appreciate being on this bill and all these people coming out and going to play this big room, which is fucking awesome for us. So thanks for shifting these crushing confidence and for you to start looking forward to that. So, uh, yeah, cheers.
fire burning. This goes out to uh, the, the indigenous. I've already fucking gone over this. God damn it. Like, Gadigal people in your nation. Um, we can treat our indigenous people a lot better than uh, what we've uh, been doing previously. Uh, it doesn't take much to listen to and to accept with an open heart and uh, embrace uh, another, another culture. Like, it's not hard at all. I don't know. Seems like uh, some people still have a problem with it. It could open up a whole new world to your life.
which is really obscure and no one will ever know. Um, <laughs> but yeah, Crash is singing it. It's not about Maruba. It's about Maruba. <laughs> in, in WA, right? <laughs> Thanks for having us tonight, by the way, Crash. You're a fucking legend. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, this is my little band called Rancid. Thank you. 
Now I knew Ben Lee when he was a piggly fucking kid from Vaucluse and it did not give me one iota of consolation. So I wrote a song of reply, it's called We're All In This Alone. He's about a pedophile killing vigilante. Set right on the day that Donald Trump became president of the United States of America. What a cut! <laughs> well, there it goes. Some megalomaniac dickhead manipulator. As the vote stuck, faded black. But here we are. It's called as good as gone. Yeah. 
song written by our guitarist Dub Lewis about rising above all of the voices who tell you that you can't do what you want to do. Even those ones inside your own mind. It's called Rise Up. Yeah. Thank you. 
Good. Mark, they call Australia a lucky country. And that may be. Maybe so. Maybe not so. But if there is one way in which we're fortunate, it's our gun control. Because in the land of the free, where they wear the right to bear arms like a badge of honour, so we're going to shut us back.
This song, this song, this song's about bullies. It's called You're So Capable of Ugliness. Are you capable of any beauty?
Lewis on guitars, Rico Sullivan on bass guitar, and Freedom Barham on drums. And the luckiest frontman in Maroubra Punk Rock. I just want to thank the Factory Theatre, Tal for inviting us to play, Operation Ibis for, for coming on board, Shit Tibby's my brothers for playing with us, and for letting me sing on a track of theirs, it's coming out in, in March I think also, the cover of Olympia WA. Yeah. <laughs> and the Mighty Boys Club are going to take us down to Suffragette City as soon as we finish. Don't lean on me man. we got two to go. This is a song I wrote about my children and how much I love them. The happiness that you bring me. Why can't they get over it? Fucking attitude around Australia Day. You know, all of us privileged fucking white people who can't get our heads out of our asses for long enough to see the First Nations, the traditional owners, the Aboriginal point of view when it comes to January 26th being a celebration. I want, I want, I want, I want, I want fuck, he's a different colour, but we're the same kid. I treat him like my brother, who treat me like his. And until enough fucking white people get in, as incensed about it as our Aboriginal community is, there'll never be unity, and I want unity. That's why we're playing White Riot.
club. We have a new member.
for nine